This is group division using the stamp game, having a zero in the divisor. So the problem is 6,381 divided by 203. And my dividend is here, made with stamps, 6,381. Here's my divisor, 203. So the question is, how many groups of 203 can I create with this dividend? And as before, I'm going to create, I'm going to use three digits at a time to show my groups. So I'll use thousands to re represent the hundreds, place of the divisor. I'll use hundreds to represent the tens place of the divisor, but there's a zero in the tens place, so I won't take any hundreds right now. And I'll use tens to represent the units place of the divisor. And I'm going to leave a little space. So it looks like my answer for this category is going to be in the tens place. So the quotient will be in the tens place. Let's continue. Hundreds for the tens place, which is a zero. And then tens. And I'll need to exchange one of these hundreds for ten tens to complete this group. And I have no more thousands. So this tells me that my answer, which is in the tens place, is three. There are three groups of 203 tens in my dividend. So now I'm ready to move on to the units place of the, of the quotient. How many groups of 203 can I make? I'll use two hundreds to represent hundreds. I would use tens to represent the tens place, but which is a zero. And I need three units to represent the units place. I'll have to exchange one ten and here's two hundred three. There's one group of two hundred three, and I can see that there are no more hundreds in the remaining in the, in the dividend. So the answer for the units place is one, one group of 203 units. And I have a remainder, and that is 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, six, seven, eight. Eighty-eight is my remainder. So the remainder is eighty-eight. So six thousand three hundred eighty-one divided by two hundred three equals thirty-one. That means there's thirty-one groups of two hundred three in this dividend with a remainder of 88.